Greetings, dear friends, in the strong name of our Lord Jesus. Welcome to another point of view, where we get to think through the a truth uh, related to the homily of the week. And this week, the second Sunday of Advent, we concentrated on Luke chapter 1, verses 68 through 79. Uh, I gave the theme of that wonderful passage, the Lord visits and redeemed his people, the second a week of Advent Annunciation. And the thesis of the sermon was the Lord God of Israel promised to visit and redeem his people, having raised up a horn of salvation for them in the house of David. And in today's meditation, I'd like us to focus on the promise that God gave through the prophets. He promised to show mercy to the people of Israel and to remember his covenant oath, his holy covenant that he swore to their father, Abraham. The prophets constantly spoke of God being faithful to fulfill the promise that he made to Abraham and Isaac and Jacob and all the patriarchs. An example of that is Isaiah chapter 42, verses one through four. Behold my servant, whom I uphold, my chosen, in whom my soul delights, a prophecy regarding the Messiah. I have put my spirit upon him. He will bring forth justice to the nations. He will not cry aloud or lift up his voice or make it heard in the street. A bruised reed he will not break and a faintly burning wick he will not quench. He will faithfully bring forth justice. He will not grow faint or be discouraged till he has established justice in the earth and the coastlands wait for his law. The promise of the future is that God will visit us and redeem his very own. 